Novak Djokovic versus Rafael Nadal is the second semi-final for the Men's French Open for 2021. And both players are about to fight their way into the semi-finals. Rafael Nadal came into this tournament as the number three seed and would play Alexi Popperin in the first round. And after a tight third set, Rafa would eventually get through in three, six, three, six, two, seven, six. His second round opponent was an opponent he was all too familiar with, Risha Gasquet. And after a close second set, again, Rafa got through in straight sets, Six love, seven five, six two. His third round opponent was against fellow lefty Cam Nori, and this was a clinic from Nadal, winning in straight sets, six three, six three, six three. His fourth round opponent was the much hyped 18th seed Yannick Sinner, and these two had met last year at the French Open with a close first set, and this match would be no different. With Sinner putting up a fight in the first set, but then Rafa taking over, getting through in straight, seven five, six three, six love. In the quarterfinals, Rafa would take on the number ten seed Schwartzman, and after losing the second set, Rafa rebounded to win in four, six, three, four, six, six, four, six, love. Novak Djokovic entered the French Open as the number one seed and took on Tennis Sangren in the first round. And it was no problem for Novak getting through in straight sets, six, two, six, four, six, two. His second round opponent was against shot maker Quavos. Djokovic wasn't affected by the shot maker, winning in straight sets, six, three, six, two, six, four. His third round opponent was against Berenkis. And after a close second set, Djokovic blew Berenkis out in the third set, six, one, six, four, six, one. His fourth round opponent was against Italian young gun, Musetti, and this match turned into an epic. With the world number one having to come back from two sets down, eventually winning in five, six, seven, six, seven, six, one, six, love, four, love, retirement. In his quarterfinal, Djokovic would take on the number nine seed, Teo Berrettini, who had a very impressive clay court season into the French Open. And after winning the first two sets easily, Djokovic struggled to finish the match, but eventually got through in four, six, three, six, two, six, seven, seven, five. These two have played 57 times before with Djokovic leading their head-to-head -head just 29-28. But the last three matches they've played on clay have gone to Nadal, including a couple of weeks ago in the Rome final. If Rafa's gonna win, he needs to just be the king of clay. He needs to make sure that he gets the ball back, keeping it deep, and make Djokovic move, because that's what Berrettini did, and it really worked for him. So if Rafa can do the same, he's going to get through this one. If Djokovic is going to win, he needs to be patient, and he also needs to make sure he doesn't let the crowd affect him, because the crowd was affecting him a little bit back in the Berrettini match in the quarterfinals. He needs to make sure he's patient, and he needs to play a little bit like Schwartzman did against Rafa, taking time away from the King of Clay. This match is always a blockbuster, goat versus goat, and it's always impossible to pick, but because it's on a clay court, I'm going to go with Rafa in five sets, I think it's going to be an absolute classic with the winner making the final and being the favorite for sure in that final. But let me know down in the comments below, who do you think's winning this GOAT battle?